Hey YouTubers, so Cal Jeep Gladiator here. Hope you guys are having a great Saturday. Hey, I just want to show you an alternate option for a bed rack. Um, you know, there's tons of questions about, hey, what do you do for a bed rack? And boy, there are a lot of great options out there to get a full bed rack or a mid-height bed rack. Only problem I had with those is that it kind of takes up your whole truck bed. So if you had a full rack on here, <clears throat> out to here, and, and it seals you know seals up the top if you have to go to home depot or something to get a fridge or go help someone move some furniture you're kind of sol unless you take the rack out which is kind of a pain so did some searching and i found this option from fabtech it's the gladiator the fabtech gladiator bed rack they call it i'll put a link below in the description picked it up from quadratech it's on sale for 500 bucks and there it is. It just it sits on the quarter. It takes up not even a quarter. Well, maybe about a quarter of the bed space. All right, it's really solid. And here are the mounts for um, my roto packs. They are on order, but they're back ordered like everything else due to COVID. And it just kind of gives a whole new option. It keeps the bed open. So when I go over landing, or go for a wheeling, I uh, can slide my totes right up under it so I don't take any bed space. And I have storage, I'll have my Rotopacks, one on each side, it's give me six extra gallons of fuel. I also got this on Amazon, the little MTM ammo crate, and I think it was like $25. And I drilled some holes in the bottom of it, got some stainless uh, screws, threaded uh, nylock washers and um, some split nylock nuts and split washers and I mounted it right inside I got a can of uh, spray spray plastic dip and just lined the inside so it kind of helped dead the noise and also since it's a little rubbery it'll kind of help so uh, by you know vibration and make sure stuff doesn't rattle too much in there and I think that's a really great little option for those who do not want to spend 1500 bucks on a full bed rack and take up their whole rack because here they can get, uh, they have uh, shovel and uh, high lift jack adapters that will bolt right into those holes and uh, my high lift is going to go right here and two roto packs and I might put another one on there. I figured that's my uh, roadside emergency kit. I'll put a tow strap, a shackle hitch, a couple soft shackles, jumper cables and some gloves in there. Uh, air hose to hook up to my compressor in case someone needs some help on the way. Be a good Samaritan. But there, room for two rotopacks. Uh, shovel and high lift to go right there. Keeps the bed open. Install was pretty easy. It uh, pretty much bolted right up. You do need a second set of hands to drop this uh, that middle piece in. Because what they do, they have you do is they have you put the both side pieces on first, leave them in loose, kind of get them in somewhat in a position. Then you and someone else hold that middle section and put the bolts through and then tighten it down. Then tighten uh, the bed rail down. They have this option for both uh, with uh, cargo rails and without. Um, this I paid full price for it through Cogitech, and I just think it's so far went in really nice. Can't wait to use it more. It's really solid. It holds supports 150 pounds, and I jiggle it and the truck moves, so it's uh, it's solid. And I just spaced it just enough so I can get my opener to lock and open without problem. So I'll kick a Cyrus for a little while. My roto packs should be coming in here in a couple weeks. Get that mounted up. Maybe do a little follow-up video. All right, thanks everyone. Hope you're enjoying the really nice weekend. And I'll talk to you later.